Dave Chappelle facing backlash tonight after his Saturday Night Live appearance. Chappelle opened the show talking about Kanye West and anti-Semitism. Marla Taylor's here with the fallout. Christine, Dave Chappelle is no stranger to controversy or to Saturday Night Live. His appearance this past weekend was his third time hosting. Could it be his last? I denounce anti-Semitism in all its forms. <laughs> Dave Chappelle's opening monologue on Saturday Night Live began with advice to Kanye West after West has virtually been canceled over his recent anti-Semitic comments. And I stand with my friends in the Jewish community. And that, Kanye, is how you buy yourself some time. The monologue gradually growing more controversial, negotiating a fine line between appropriately denouncing anti-Semitism and echoing classic anti-Semitic tropes. I've been Hollywood, this was just what I saw. It's a lot of Jews. <laughs> just substitute another group for that and think about how that would sound. TMZ's Harvey Levin, who's Jewish, condemning Chappelle for perpetuating a racist stereotype. But then to say that you can think it, just don't say it, opens the door to that trope, and it is simply anti-Semitic. The CEO of the Anti-Defamation League writing in part, disturbing to see SNL not just normalize, but popularize anti-Semitism. Why are Jewish sensitivities denied or diminished at almost every turn? To others, including some fellow comics, Chappelle is just doing his job. I thought it was funny. Comedian Jimmy Lee is known for his show, Dangerously Funny, which he films often on the streets of L.A. Wokeness is killing today's comedy. I do old school style offensive insult comedy. It's making it harder for me to go on the street and make fun of people. Chappelle, who reportedly changed his monologue last minute and performed a different version during rehearsal, would probably agree. It shouldn't be this scary to talk. So far, no formal statement from NBC, Saturday Night Live, or Chappelle himself, Christine.